Hi, it's Park Madden from the Weather Store in Sandwich, Massachusetts. Today, I'm gonna to answer a question that a lot of people have, and they say, where is the best place to hang a barometer? And a lot of people think that a barometer should be hung on an outdoor wall. I mean, like inside the house, but on an outdoor facing wall. Now, the thing about air pressure is that it is the same throughout the house as it is outside. So it really doesn't matter where you hang it. If you come in my store, you can see I've got uh, barometers on the back there, inside here, back walls here, interior walls here. I have them everywhere and they're all responding to changes in pressure uh, equally well. Uh, your house, as I like to explain to people, your house is not airtight. And every time a door opens or uh, a window opens, it f even further equalizes pressure. Uh, there might be micro, micro changes in air pressure throughout the house, but certainly not enough to register on a barometer. Um, another thing while I'm on the subject is that there's really no need to mount a barometer outside because it's outside and inside being the same air pressure, it, it really doesn't matter. So it is a nice thing about a barometer in that regard is that it works indoors while telling you what's going on outdoors. So that's one of the things I always love about barometers. So I hope that helps answer your question. Um, I guess maybe furthermore along the lines, maybe just use common sense. I wouldn't put a barometer in a place where say maybe there's a lot of sunlight coming down on it because sometimes barometers have thermometers on them. It's going to read a high temperature. I wouldn't put it right next to an air conditioning or heating ventilating system. Uh, just a place, you know, where you use common sense, maybe like where you'd hang a nice picture or a clock on the wall. So um, anyway, I hope that helps answer your question. And, um, you know, please feel free to subscribe or ask even further questions on the, on the website here on YouTube. Thanks again for watching.